we're going to do a demonstration of a collection, an AI on German Shepherd Dog. We have our bag, our syringe, our AI uh, tube, pipette, non spermicidal lube, gloves, and lactated ringers in case we need extra to push in. Uh, he's usually a very good collector, so uh, we may not need that at all. Okay, I'm going to collect Tyco on a male. You want to make sure he, he enjoys this a lot. Too much, probably. Make sure you get past the prostate back here. So you pull the foreskin back. And he, he's a real good collector. So we'll take a second. And he's going to start humping. He's gonna, he likes to get real easy to get him past his prostate and get him going. As you can see, he collects real good. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> Oh yes, him's a good boy. Come on, going out running. <laughs> oh man, I'm literally holding okay. him up. Yeah, he he's collects good. So we pull it to the back, as if to simulate a tie. Um, as you see, I have my hand pressed up against the prostate to keep it nice and tight to simulate that tie, so we can get a good collection. Yeah, he's still still trying to step over. Put your foot down, bud. We got gotcha. you. Yeah, we got gotcha. you, good boy. You want to make sure you get a really good collection so you take your time because you have the first part is a, a fluid that's a, a prosthetic fraction and then you have the actual semen and then you have more prostate fluid after that. We'll also show putting the in semen inside the female German Shepherd to pal. This is our volunteer Tyco. He's from Key West, Florida. He's a really good boy. Some ties on dogs can last five minutes up to 20 minutes or so. So um, this gentleman here um, stays a very long time. So he's a he's a good, strong breeder. He's drooling on the couch. <laughs> he's drooling on the couch. Dale is having to hold him up because he's over it. He's done. Okay, I don't need any more because he's filled this up quite well and I'll show you the fraction of uh, semen we have in here uh, shortly. Okay, and you make sure that his penis goes back in. So make sure that at some point his penis goes in so it doesn't get stuck out. Okay, this milky look you want. And then, uh, like I said, he's got quite uh, a good output. So. We're going to suck this up into a, a syringe and go ahead and put it inside to pow and hope for the best since she's ovulating. See, this is the second syringe. We have two syringes. I'm going to follow up with the second one so I don't have to. I emptied out the <laughs> fluid and then just had to put semen in there. So we're about to put do this. Put some gloves on so you don't get any bacteria into the vagina. It's a dirty enough area anyway. And spermicidal, the non-spermicidal lube. And I'm going to lube the tube and then place it inside her vagina. Okay, let's raise her up. Her on my... Oh, there we go. There we go. I'm going to put her on my knee. Come on. Let's put her leg down. Mm -hmm. Find it. Make sure you stick your finger in to guide it so you don't hurt her. And also make sure you don't get it in the bladder. Make sure you find it. Roll it in with your finger. That's how I do it to make sure I'm not inside the bladder. She's already pulsating on me. Okay, I'll squeeze one. Okay. I'm going to squeeze number two. And then I'm going to push some air behind that. And then I'm going to behind that. Whoop, 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 whoop. Hold still, baby. We'll put some air behind that to push it in further to make sure. And, and then I'm going to massage. And why do you massage? This helps her contract. It's uh, feathering her vulva. And uh, it makes her contract for the semen, semen to vulva. suck inside there. And, closer to her uterus and make sure that she 
actually takes. It simulates the tie for her as well. I feel her pulsating. That's, that's exactly what you want. The pulse, just like I've got right now. And then we crater for like 30 minutes to make sure she doesn't urinate behind it. Okay, let's go ahead and put her up. Thank you for watching. This is Sandra and Dela, the grandma from WDR, coming to you from Vanilla, Florida.